Ralph Young at Lee Filters. Ralph's the uh, sales director at Lee Filters and he's kindly giving us a tour of the factory, Ralph. We've yep. seen part of the process here with, uh, what, what have we just seen here? Explain well, a little bit. The, you've seen the initial starting process of where we actually cast our glass cells. We start off with a resin liquid, yep. place it into the cells, put it into the oven to cure it yep. for over a 24 hour period. Once we've done that, the cells come out of the oven, then we would actually split them yep. and then take them into the next process where they go for their its first inspection right. after coming out of the uh, baking process. Right. And, and today we're also gonna see how, how some of the grads are made. We're gonna look at some of the lighting gels because great news is we're gonna be producing some of our own uh, leaf filter packs and Carl Taylor leaf filter packs for the resin, grad filters, ND filters and lighting packs. And working with these guys, are going to show us the whole process on how these things are made. So I'm really excited and really looking forward to that. Great, oh. lead the way, Ralph. Okay. So, Ralph, where are we at now? What's the so next we're stage? At the second, we're at the second stage process now. So what we're going to do in this room, the sheets have come out of the oven, they've been transferred into here. They're going through an inspection process. And if you look on the right-hand side there, this piece of equipment yep. is quite important. Um, what we have to do is measure every single sheet for hardness. Okay. Um, for several reasons, but some of the, some of the dyes stuff die quicker than others, and we have to control that. So right. we do that by the, the, the hardness and density of the sheet. Okay. So um, would you like to see it? Yes, please. Gemma, yeah. could you uh, run through that for us, please? So we just place, place it on, on, underneath the uh, yep. machine there, and then what we'll do is, Gemma, if you would like to hit the buttons, Sort of pressure testing. But it's is pressure it? testing. It's exactly what the, it is. Uh, yeah. Oh, I see. It's, yeah, it's really starting to bend. Yeah. Again. Okay. Once that's done, that that transfers the data onto the computer. Yeah. And from that, they can make the right decision on what that sheet is. Okay. And put it for the right selection for the right. filters it's going so, to be made so, into. So based on the hardness of the sheet and the, the pressure that that measures, then that will determine what that can be used for. Correct. Right. Yeah. Okay. And then uh, following that, um, you said it moves on to... Yeah, but the, the next section is obviously we've checked the pressure, we're happy with, with the pressure, but we also want to make sure that optically the product is acceptable okay. before we even start dyeing. Right, okay. So it, it goes through several of those processes, but this is the first process and it's the most important. Right. Um, if it fails, then it just doesn't leave this room, it would, it would be scrapped. Right. Um, unfortunately, these things happen sometimes, so... We don't want it getting through the process. No, no, absolutely. Your quality. So what we would do is, is if you look there, basically you've got a, a focusing screen. Yep. You have this apparatus. They place the filter in there. Yep. That will look through it, and if, if it sees that it's not flat, it will show up on that screen. From this room, into the next room, it gets cut into sections, and then from there, the operator selects their sheet and dyes the filter, which is which what, is, I'm which get is get what you're going to do in a moment. <laughs> Excellent. Yeah. All right, we're looking forward to that. Okay. Brilliant. Okay. Okay, Ralph, this is looking interesting. What's happening? Well, this is now to the stage where you've seen the last process where we've done the checking of the hardness, etc. Yeah. Shirley's now selected her sheet. Yeah. All right. She's marked it up to where she wants the graduation That's area to, here, to, on the side. Yeah. Okay. And then from this, it's going to be submerged into the hot dye tank, and this is where their experience comes in because you'll you'll notice that they're all done by hand. It's a hand process. Okay. Right. So what my suggestion is that Shirley starts this off. Yeah and then you take over and let's see where see, you get to. And then when you I, get to that stage, right wrist action. we'll move you across into the spec area and show you all that and see where you, how you take it from there. All right, okay, how about brilliant. that? Okay. All right, let's see what Shirley could do with it. <laughs> so basically, that's gonna be submerged into this tank. Correct. And that's what adds the graduated tint to the, uh, to the filter. Correct. Right, we're going to do a hard grad. A hard grad, okay. So it's just a straight line. Right. So you just put it into where the line comes from. Yeah. And just slightly wiggle it a little bit. Just 
just move it a tiny bit. Yeah. And how long do you have to keep it in there for? How do you know? Is that just experience? Just keep, yeah. And just keep going back and forth and bring it the Right. That will obviously depend on what the density of the filter is. So if, yeah. if it's going to be a 0.9, you know it's going to be in there for a, for a long considerably time. longer than it is a 0.3. Right. Yeah, we'll do a middle one. So right. we'll probably do about 10 minutes. Right, okay. And then on the soft grad, I'm assuming you've just got to move it more so the spread is going up and yeah. down. That's exactly what it is. Right, okay. There are other ways of doing methods that people say, but we, we actually believe that this is the best way to get the transition of a grad yeah. rather than using mechanical machinery to right. do it, in all honesty. Right. Take it out every now and again. Like so, so you inspect it every now and again? Yeah, just, just so. wipe it over so you don't get the steam lines. Yes. Yeah. Obviously, the <coughs> steam and everything, and yeah. it sort of goes and turn it over as well. Okay. See, all, all, of these, all of these, all the same for different... Absolutely, brands, yeah. yeah. So um, what my suggestion would be now is that Shirley takes it over there and shows you what she's got to. Yeah. Right. And then she'll and then you take over. Okay, yeah. How about great. That? Yeah, let's have a look. I'm looking forward to this. <laughs> So you need 52, so it's only halfway there at the moment, just under halfway there. So you've done half of it and I've got to do the other half. <laughs> you know this is going to go spectacularly wrong. <laughs> yeah. Up to? Up to that line. Up to the line, yeah. Yeah, so just here, like that. And then just a little bit of movement. So we're going to get to a stage where we're going to say yeah. it's a pass, okay. but it will say fail on there. It's a big bloody <laughs> change. <laughs> if that passes, I'll give him a job. Yeah. We'll see if it's going to say ATND. Yeah. <laughs> Only 39. See, so it needs more time in. Yeah. So that was meant to be a what? what a point six. So I've made you a point four. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> A 0.4 filter. Now, a 0.4 filter, Ralph, is not one that was going to be in the new sets that we're producing, so this is a fail. Right, on my okay, part. All not, right. not your fault, but my, my fault completely. It's yeah. a fail, um, but yeah, very excited. Although this one's a fail, these guys, the experts, will be making the proper ones for our new filter sets, which is going to be uh, fantastic. Very much looking forward to it. Uh, how, how was I uh, line-wise? Was well, it straight? Let's, let's have a look. <laughs> Oh, that's that, it's actually not too bad. It doesn't look too bad, Ralph, does yeah. it? Oh, actually, that's because... I, hang on, let me stand straight. I was doing that. Ah, right, right. So it's not, yep. it's not quite... It's right. excellent. That's it's not bad. For a first time, not that's bad. not bad. Well, it, Is it Shirley? It's thanks to Shirley's <laughs> help. She's not looking yeah. convinced. <laughs> <laughs> thanks very much. Thank you, you're welcome. So, Ralph, we're getting more to the finishing stages now? We are, yeah. We've now taken it from the dyeing process, the cutting of the final size of the product. It then comes into this room, and then what Tracy and her team will do, they will inspect the filter yep. for any flaws, etc. They shouldn't happen because the girls and the boys next door are pretty good, but we have to have final inspection. Absolutely. Once uh, Tracy and her team are happy with the, the quality of the finished product, they'll then take it through to a printing process, which we can get Tracy to show you now. Excellent. So that's what. So tell us, Tracy, what's uh, what's happening? So we take the filter and we clean it with um, acetone. Okay. Just to get all the, any fingerprints and yep. any smears off. Just have a quick look, just to make a final look, just to make sure there's no scratches or anything. Sure. Then it goes onto this table. And that. Well, that did what? That printed, that printed ah, the name of that the... told us what it is, and yeah. that is a blue, the real blue two grad two six hard. grad hard. Excellent. And then it just has a blow, and then it goes into the tracing paper, just to give it a bit of protection. Yes. Before it goes into its final soft case pack and box. Yeah. So 
How many of those could you do in an hour at a push if he was really, if Ralph was stood here watching you? Probably, <laughs> probably up to between 50 and 100. Right, brilliant. And there's obviously few of you doing that as well. So, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. excellent. It's a, it's a shame, really, because if, if your filter had passed, yeah. we could have got that far with it. Yeah. But as soon as it failed, it's mine not going to get wrapped and printed, Mine is doesn't it? make Lee Filter's quality it, control, no, unfortunately. It, but there we go. But anyway, excellent. Well, thanks for your time, Tracy. Okay, no thank you. Brilliant. Thank you. Now, Ralph. I haven't seen this name before. Super no. Stopper. Well, actually, this is a bit of an exclusive for you, actually, because we haven't launched it. Right, OK. So this is uh, another stopper for the for the big stopper and little stopper family. It's a super stopper. It's 15 stops. 15 stops. And right. it Excellent. will be available very, very soon. Brilliant. Uh, in a matter of weeks. Excellent. So this is really exciting. We're in the department where they do the finishing stage. And here is our first uh, prototype um, box sets of our pro sets with our different grad filters, uh, stopper filters in there as well, the holders and the landscape polarizing that you can uh, control independently from the grad. So really great to see the, uh, the final stages on, uh, on these new sets that we're gonna be producing.